Hey everybody, what's up? Welcome to Farm Sim 19. Today we are looking at this Freightliner 108 SD manure spreader. So this is the Freightliner truck that I did. This is the same truck as the spreader truck for the lime and the fertilizer, but I put a JBS VMT 2248 on the back. This was originally a tow behind spreader. I think it was like an EMC 2248 or something. But I went ahead and changed it. Um, I added these fenders. So now we have fenders on the truck. And we have no more tong and PTO set up up front. But everything still works. I had to go in a blender and cut a few pieces off. We're going to assign some materials, redo a few things, but no big deal. Still functions as intended. I think it looks pretty sweet. The ones I saw actually did not have, uh, or they weren't on trucks with big tires like this, like high foundation tires. Most of them that I saw were just on like regular road tires. And I figured that wasn't going to be adequate. Um, I, was go I was going for this look. I saw a bunch of trucks that looked like this too. They had the big, wide, high flotation tires, so... I couldn't help it, I had to put it on, and I think it looks awesome. Truck sitting up high, big wide tires. Of course these tires have a tire deformation too. It's a big beefy tread on there. Uh, let's go ahead and start it up, and I'll show you. No custom sounds for this guy. Eh. It's alright, it's a truck. Of course, all the lights work, beacons work, I'll show you the turn signals, hazards, those work obviously. Let's come over to our field here. Uh, this is kind of all already done up, so let's go ahead and change the field to nothing. Turn our time down. And let's fill it up with the manure. Now the fill plane is kind of weird in this truck. Uh, that's the way it was. I tried to kind of fix it. It didn't really work. It's really not the best looking, but it's what I have for this truck. And it's what came with the spreader, so that's what we're going to go with. And I do not know how to make a new one. So First thing we do, unfold it. Now you'll notice this is clipping, this door clips here. Um, that's the way it was on the original spreader. I tried to fix it, I couldn't really fix it without it throwing everything off. So, I think that's the way the original model was. I tried, but small detail. So let's go ahead and turn it on. All the animations work, obviously. I think you're limited to nine miles an hour. Spreading manure. the beacons on there and on this truck you have options for a chrome front bumper chrome mirrors and you can put this chrome front uh, grill trim piece on there or you can just have a solid colored hood I made sure to give this truck some good suspension movement Imagine these tires are pretty soft. What else? Interior is okay. Uh, it's not the best. His mirrors. Interior is from a lizard truck, I believe. Uh, gauges don't work. But it's passable. Typical manure spreader. I'll show you the truck will get dirty all the way. So that's what it looks like when it's completely dirty.
But anyways, that's pretty much it. Not too much else to this truck. It's a pretty basic truck. It was a quick little mod. I really like the truck mounted equipment in Farm Sim. I don't know why. It seems simpler just to have a truck uh, than to have to detach whatever you have attached to your tractor and then go find whatever. You know, you gotta detach your grain cart to go spread some manure or whatever. I like the trucks. You can just park the truck, pull it out, drive it, and then this thing flies between fields too. So say we were empty. Now I can cruise back to the cows at 50 miles an hour. Not stuck going like 20. So a couple of reasons why I like the truck mount stuff. Plus it's just cool and I had this chassis which I really didn't know what to do with. Now I don't really know if this is accurate. I don't know if you'd exceed the gross vehicle weight rating of this truck um, which is about 60,000 pounds. I don't know if you'd exceed that with the, a full load of manure. I don't know how much manure weighs but I saw some other similar trucks like this. Uh, this truck can get a Cummins L9 as the most powerful option. So I think the engine power is there. Gross vehicle weight may be a bit light, but oh well. But anyways guys, thanks for watching. If you like this video, leave a like, leave a comment, tell me your thoughts down below, and I will catch you again in the next one.